We're here in the sunny and vibrant city of Coimbatore at the Koei SDD High Performance Center to test ride the updated 2024 TVS Apache Rural Route 310. Since its debut in 2017, this motorcycle has undergone several upgrades, the most notable being in 2021 with the introduction of the BTO model, race kits, and adjustable suspension. At first glance, the 2024 version retains much of the familiar design, but there are some exciting new tweaks, like the addition of winglets and a transparent clutch cover. Under the hood, there are improvements to the engine and NVH noise, vibration, and harshness levels, along with some fresh tech upgrades. Given that we're on the track, we'll be putting the bike through its paces in track mode to see how it performs at its best. Design Highlights the 2024 Apache Rural Route 310 sports new winglets on the front fairing designed to enhance downforce. While they add a distinctive touch, the placement of the turn indicators just below the winglets feels a bit awkward and might raise questions about their aerodynamic impact. Another standout feature is the transparent clutch cover, a rare, eye-catching addition typically seen as an aftermarket modification on larger capacity motorcycles with dry clutches. It's a small detail, but adds a premium, sporty vibe. Features and Tech Today, we're riding the model equipped with the Dynamic Pro package, which brings a host of advanced features. This includes everything from the Dynamic package, TPMS, tire pressure monitoring system, fully adjustable suspension, traction control, and cruise control, plus some high-tech additions. The highlight is the Racetune Dynamic Stability Control, RDDSC powered by a six-axis IMU. This system manages advanced features like cornering traction control, cornering ABS, and overall stability, ensuring precise handling and performance. Even when leaning into a corner with cruise control activated, the bike automatically adjusts its speed based on the selected ride mode. However, it's puzzling that TVS didn't equip the track-ready version with rear-set foot pegs. This omission was a bit of a letdown as the standard pegs scrape the ground when pushing hard into aggressive leans. That said, the bike doesn't skimp on premium features. It comes with a brass-coated chain, fully adjustable suspension, customizable levers, five ride modes, and a full suite of electronics, delivering the complete package for tech-savvy riders. Engine One of the standout upgrades for this model is the engine. While its core design remains unchanged, power has been bumped up by an impressive 11%. The 2024 Rural Route 310 now delivers 38 PS at 9,800 RPM and 29 Newton meters of torque at 7,900 RPM, shaving the 0 to 100 km per hour sprint time to just 6.74 seconds, as per TVS's claims. The top speed is now rated at 164 km per hour, which is remarkable for a machine in this category. Another noteworthy enhancement is the addition of a new forged piston. This piston is significantly lighter and features a specialized coating that reduces NVH, noise, vibration, and harshness levels, particularly in the mid and upper rev ranges. The result? A smoother, more refined riding experience compared to the engine in the naked RTR 310. Ride and handling. As with previous iterations, the RR310 remains a sport-focused motorcycle, and its aggressive riding stance puts noticeable weight on your palms. While the reduced NVH levels make the ride smoother, this isn't a bike designed for leisurely cruising. The RR310 thrives at speed, urging you to unleash its performance potential every time you hit the road or track. If you ride fast or you like riding fast, or if you're into long-distance rides at decent clip out on the highway, you will have a complete blast on this bike. But riding slow, it will get a bit tiresome, especially on your palms because you have a lot of weight on there. Now this updated for 2024 model is a lot more user-friendly. Even the brakes and the suspension, the way you can tune it up the way you like is really nice. All things considering the tires perform really well, the Michelin Road 5s. And the only downside I say about this motorcycle is the fact that this, well, this Dynamic Pro version with the RTDSC on it, is, of course, you have a lot of electronics to fiddle around with like traction control, ABS, cornering traction control, anti-wheelie and anti-stoppy, and stuff like that. But then you cannot pick and choose what you want to have active and deactivated, because you only have two options. 
You can either have all of them active or have all of them shut off. So that is a little disappointing in a way. But hopefully, with the future update, they will include that feature where you can actually select what you want to have active on this motorcycle. Pricing of the 2024 TVS Apache Rural Route 310 starts off at 2.75 rupees lakh. X showroom for the standard model in the red paint and goes up to around 3.31 rupees lakh for the dynamic pro kit bike in the gray paint scheme, making it the most feature rich motorcycle in its class. Minus the race replica paint job for which you will have to shell out a good 7k for. It feels quicker now and just as nice and nimble, very flickable agility wise, just as it was before and now a lot more refined and not as rough around the edges as the earlier model. But it's still not the quickest bike in its class. And if you can settle for that fact, this updated 2024 Rural Route 310 is a very enticing motorcycle. Yes, sure, there are others in this segment that perform better, but this one takes the cake as far as riding aids and factory customization goes. It looks good and feels a lot more special now that it's not so gruff. After a short track experience with the updated RR310 model, it in fact feels like a better motorcycle, especially because of the reduced NVH levels. More power, always welcome, and the fact that it now gets some features borrowed from the naked version of this motorcycle, which is the RTR310, is a big plus point as well. Now how this motorcycle fares out on the road. We'll have to we'll save our judgment for that on a later date when we actually read it out on the road.